Hello, welcome to the Spoon Fork Heart Kitchen. สวัสดีค่ะ My name is Siri. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a Thai pasta stir fry or Thai people like to call pad macaroni. Let's look our ingredient. Today I use the avo macaroni, uh, chicken, egg, s i l a c h a sauce, cooking oil, cooking sauce, butter, oyster sauce, sugar, tomato paste, garlic, and the vegetable. I have the bell pepper, onion, tomato, and green onion, salt, and pepper. Let's start cooking. Let's get our pasta started first. Okay, and now when we wait the uh, our pasta cooking, let's start uh, prepare vegetable and the uh, cooking sauce. Let's start cut our vegetable. Cut the my bell pepper. I gonna put it in the cup for lady when we cooking. It's nice and easy. So, all right. Next, I gonna cut our onion. You can use any kind of onion too. Today I have the white onion already, so that why I using the white onion. But you can use yellow or l a c e onion. Now I cut the onion. It's cut um, the same size as the you cut the, the bell pepper. Onion only give me the hard time when I cut it. <laughs> All the time make me tear. Okay, I gonna use just like um, a quarter of onion. Okay, now I done with the onion and bell pepper, green onion and tomato and the garlic. I love garlic actually. <laughs> That smells so strong, but they always taste good in the food. Okay, and now I we finish cutting our vegetable. Perfect time, our pasta is done. Let me remove the pasta. Then I'm gonna strain this. Now I can I strain all the pasta and I gonna let it sit and make our sauce. Come back and make the sauce. Uh, to, uh, this is tomato paste. In Thailand, sometimes they uh, had uh, difficult for us to find the tomato paste. Sometimes they use the um, ketchup and this uh, home mix is l a c h a sauce. If you like spicy, you can add some more. And the soy sauce or seasoning sauce, some oyster sauce. It make it easy when you make the sauce already. Okay, some sugar and mix it well together until the sugar and all the sauce. Uh, mix well together. All the sugar dissolve. And now our vegetable and our sauce is done. So let's start cooking. Okay, first I gonna turn on the stove to medium and add the cooking oil. Now I will walk and the oil hot enough. So I gonna add the garlic first. Uh, I like this garlic when the oil and the wok is hot and you put the garlic, they kind of perfect cook. Cook the garlic until a golden brown and give you very good smell before you add the chicken. Oh, uh, garlic lady! I gonna add the chicken. Today I use the chicken, but you can use uh, any kind of meat that you like. 
um, for example, you can change to be the seafood, that would be so delicious too. Shrimp, even squid, oh, I love that too. But the chicken is uh, liquid by the crema, man, no why. Now when we uh, cook the chicken, I'm gonna add our butter. It gives you extra nice flavor with the butter. That will be good with a lot of food. Let the cook a little bit until the chicken is well done and we're gonna add the um, a pasta. Okay, soon your chicken done, uh, as your pasta because you don't want to overcook the chicken. You still want that to be, oh, the butter makes it very nice smell, I love this. Okay, now I add the pasta and I'm gonna give it a very good mix. Oh, look. Okay, I'm gonna add the bell pepper and the white onion. The same time when you add the pasta, as a vegetable can go in. Okay, now uh, allow the vegetable to cook a little bit. And now when you allow the vegetable to cook just a second, I'm gonna add the egg now. I try to make the spread into the middle, but <laughs> a little bit hard. Put the line to the middle. After your egg is cooked, now I'm gonna come to add our sauce. Mix well before you add it and just add the sauce. And give them a very good mix, very fast. Oh, smell. Ugh. I'm hungry already, I want to eat this. The funny thing about this, when I be young, and I love this dish so much, I thought this is American food. <laughs> I don't know until the... Um, I have a chance to come to America and feel this is not American food. Oh, I just get it. Okay, Thai people make it. <laughs> ah, look at that. Okay, after the sauce is mixed well together, I'm gonna add the um, tomato and the green onion. And the green onion and the tomato, they cook so fast, so we almost done. I'm gonna add some um, pepper. If you cook for the kids, maybe they don't like paper, you don't have to mix the paper. Some little bit of salt, just to taste. Okay, and give them a mix again, final mix, and um, you're gonna taste your food. Okay, okay, but, and now I give them a very good uh, stir. And I'm done, and but I'm gonna try my food, don't forget to try yours. Okay, now we've done our delicious um, stir fry pasta. Okay. Okay, let's uh, put on a plate. Okay, this is still hot, but I can't wait to try this. Be careful, very really hot, so. Mm. Mm. The first when they touch my tongue, I already happy. Mm. I love it. All the salt, all the everything, it's make well cook well together. All vegetable. You even can change your vegetable to peas and carrot. I love love it. Even the kid can love it. And super easy, super delicious. This recipe quick and easy and delicious to cook. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, if you like the recipe, please give me a thumb up, subscribe, and you will see me for the next recipe. Thank you.